I've worked at this meek hotel for a quarter of my life, and let me tell you something. I've learned a thing or two about people from it. Mostly, what they don't want you to learn about them. I would not call it much of a sixth sense, but more of a hidden talent of sorts. You must be Bill. Nice to meet you. Stanley. Not quite as I pictured. Looks can be deceiving. Quite commonly, in fact. So, do you have a place or a preference? Anywhere's fine. Perfect. Perfect. There was uh, something I wanted to consult you on. I don't want to delve too deep, but your, um, your record doesn't speak too kindly about some of your previous actions. It's something that I live with, you know? I guess everybody's got to live with what they've done, you know? Aren't you getting something? Oh, no, no thank you. I'm not really hungry. If there's one thing I know is that things don't tend to go well on an empty stomach. Trust me, I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. We'll see. So, what made you decide to venture to this establishment? Oh, you know, I got close ties in this area, you know, and, you know, some ties I just gotta cut loose, you know? Figuratively, of course. <laughs> <laughs> There's no other way I could spin it. And that's how I like it spun. So, have you had any recent incidents? No, 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 no. That's all in the past. Do you plan to use your time to stay on schedule during work? Yeah, of course I do. Okay. long enough at this hotel to be able to recognize a thief from an honest employee. Thief? Good day, Mr. Bill. I said good day. Hello. Mr. Parable, there seems to be a noise complaint on floor two. Well, lucky for you, I take noise complaints very seriously. It seems that yet again my quote-unquote sixth sense has not failed me. Yes, I still have a few kinks to work out. But a win's a win, I guess. <laughs> 